here we are with Sienna Miller. Hello. My friend. And she's been kind enough to do this with me today. Super exciting. <laughs> <laughs> and so we was in my New York apartment. Now we're in What did you say? My yeah. New York. My. <laughs> so now we're in my New York apartment. Yeah. So, so you can hear yeah. that New York. Yeah, maybe we it do that again. It doesn't stop, does it? Should we do that again? I think it's quite nice. Oh, right, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's why we live in New York. Yeah, I mean, that's what happens all the time. So, what we're going to do today, I'm just going to ask her a few questions because... I'm going to try and not laugh. You yeah, know. okay, because I'm being really <laughs> professional. Namaste. Um, okay, so, what's your everyday makeup routine, skincare makeup routine? Skincare, I wash my face every day, which... With water? I deserve a medal for. <laughs> um, no, I use I use what I have lying around. So I have I get scent stuff, and yeah. I, have, I use different things. But then I use a serum and a moisturiser. I mean, what are they? Though? So Dr. Nigma does a really great serum. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know. Which I love, yeah, and yeah, cream. Yeah. And Dr. Macrian Alexialis makes this 37. It's a new thing that I'm using, that's oh. great. But on the whole, I, yeah, I mean, I clean my face, which yeah. I think is about as much as you're gonna get me to do. And I'll do a mask now and then in the bath. Any particular mask we're loving at the moment? Because things change, right, all the time, yeah? There's a glycolic Natura Bise. Do you know that brand? Oh yeah, I do, yeah, that's yeah. That's quite good, and you, yeah. put, it's like a peel. Charlotte Tilbury does a good one. Is it a like a paper mask or is it a cream? There is two masks she does. The paper okay. mask is good and the cream mask is but also good. But what one do you prefer? The creamy one. It okay. feels more mask-like. Okay, okay. So what about makeup? Makeup I use Burberry because you do my makeup <laughs> and it's the makeup I get given every time you come. But no, but you get given loads of makeup. And there must no, be no, I do. Oh, I've got mark. a Chanel box there. I love the Chanel lipsticks. There's something so classic about yeah. that to me. Um, and Marc Jacobs has got a new makeup line which is really great, colours, yeah. really cool colours. I mean you're quite experimental, I mean you, she I'm does come up with really. stuff. You know, you I do. mean I'll play with things but I'm not like, oh, I'm going to put on a blue eyeshadow. No you out. don't, but you do have ideas and so when we come to do you, she does have ideas. I do weigh in. Yeah she does a little bit. Much like. to the chagrin of Yeah it is a bit too. like, okay. No, we've got the same references, we yeah. you know, we're visual yeah. people. So. so it looks good always. Uh, and uh, and it's quite nice for someone to have an idea as long as it's cool. <laughs> and it always is, is. thank God. <laughs> um, okay, we're doing this quickly because I've got to go and get my global entry, which is really important. <laughs> I've got to and pick up my kids. Yeah, so, yeah, so I'm springing these questions on her. Next question, need to just check, hold on. What's the best <laughs> ever makeup tip you've been given? No, it says on there. <laughs> <laughs> What's the best makeup thing that I've taught you? Yeah, okay. Right. You oh. taught me about skin. You're amazing with skin, which is what you're known for. And it's true, you can make a flawless skin out of relatively little product and you taught me how to contour in a way that's not naff. Because people really overdo that, don't they? Thank you. And you do it there and there and there and there and there and there yeah. and there and that yeah, top sometimes, bit. Yeah, sometimes, yeah. All right. <laughs> well, when the All hair's the down, it's nice. Shadow, shadow, anyway. Anyway. <laughs> but sometimes when the hair's back, it's quite nice to have that. Yeah, I just find that when I do it at home, then that that, yeah. that adds something. But what's the best makeup tip that I've taught you? Oh gosh, she's taught me quite a few actually. Yeah. Oh, no, hold on, really? Yeah. I'll give you a clue, it's with a contour stick. Where you would Oh my god, yeah, it, oh my god, yeah. Amazing. Okay, yeah, yeah. I yeah. discovered Yeah, that that was. I mean, and I do say that all the time. Well you forgot it. Isn't yeah, it? I know, I've completely <laughs> forgot it, which is fucking bizarre. You can't no, say that on Yeah. Oh, I can because it's my YouTube channel, oh, sorry. So I <laughs> Funny that. Okay. Uh, uh, um, no, yes, yeah, so the tip is, the tip is, the tip is, with my contour stick, that she done the outside of the lips. A little contour. bit, yeah. Yeah, and I said, you can't do that, but she done it anyway, like the true makeup artist she is, <laughs> because that's what we do, do things that I'm not supposed to do. And, um, and then I developed that lip contour because of that. Yeah. Inspiration. I mean, yeah, that, that was, so that was the best tip that I got from you. Yeah, but you do. But come you up taught me how to do my makeup. Yeah, well, she can. Uh, you can do your makeup quite well. Sometimes she doesn't even need me. It's quite upsetting sometimes. <laughs> I mean, when she done when she done cat on a hot tin roof, we went in and done a look, and she was really good at it instantly. So I was kind of <laughs> banished, and that was it. I just to hang out in the changing room or dressing room with Teddy Rowe yeah with Teddy Rowe and a wee wee pad yeah and a wee wee pad <laughs> a bit she, chalky. she was chit chatting away you know got nothing to do she was there doing the eyeliner and everything mm. 
you know, let's do it eight times a week for 12 weeks. And oh, by the end, I was like, wow. <laughs> yeah, now you got that down. But haven't you done your makeup for some movies before? Not Did for film. You don't do it for films. When you do plays, you get a makeup artist oh. who sets the look. Right. But then you do your own makeup for shows on the whole, unless you had something crazy for a play. For a yeah. film, you can't because you can't be checking yourself. Right, okay. But you okay. have your hair done. But do you, hair look. But do you come up with, do you have any kind of uh, input in the look of your character yeah. when you do a film? When I do a film, yes. Yeah. yeah. Oh, well that's, yeah. I suppose it depends on how controlling the director is. Right. I hope that they would let you weigh in because you're the one that's playing it. Yeah, and of course you need to feel that character, so you might feel like she has a little bit yeah. of a... I like tend a to play it down. I mean, I don't want to ever... I suppose I play quite real people, so I've never... But if you played an done extra like terrestrial or something... I'd phone you. Yeah, I mean, that would be a nightmare because you'd be in makeup forever. <laughs> Prosthetics, that's oh. not fun. I've done that. I've had to age to 66. Oh, really? How long does that take? Maybe two hours or three hours to get it on. And it's glued on and it's big, thick, rubbery. Yeah. It's not fun. Yeah. Not fun, but it looks But good. it looks amazing, yeah, though. Yeah. I mean, what they do is amazing. I wasn't going to ask that question, but that kind of just developed. It's just because it's, yeah, because you're such a natural. <laughs> yeah. On your YouTube channel. <laughs> okay, next question. Um, top three beauty tips. Are we going over the same it's thing so again? It's so boring because everybody talks about it all the time, but it's true. I know, because people just want to know it about you. Yeah, okay, yeah, good point, good point. But everybody says that. It's um, true, though. I think, you know... <laughs> Go on. <laughs> a good love life makes people glow, yeah, doesn't it? Yeah, okay, like that's true, else. that's true. Um, <laughs> and what else is good? A lot of laughter. Water, laughter, love, to happy. Happiness is really, yeah. like, it's, the, it's really the key. Yeah. Because you can... Because how do you feel when you go on the red carpet and things are like happening outside of going on the red carpet and you've got to turn it on? Not great. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> I don't fucking When up. you say things... I mean, you, you know, like normal stuff, like life. Stress. Yeah, you know, like life things like, you know, um, you know, um, I've just put my kid to bed, or um, you've been there for that when yeah, I'm having no, to go no, out. No, I'll just say that, that mother, don't no, go. And no. like, I got you know, you're tripping down a dress. Yeah, yeah, and then yeah, and then you have to like turn it all off, and then suddenly get on the red carpet. What goes through your mind? I think I go into like a catatonic state. Right, <laughs> just go like, just like okay. Do you, the only time that it's been all right, I remember I was in Cannes and I was on the jury a couple of years ago. Oh yeah, that, but that was really And we had to do like a million yeah. red carpets. But the thing about that red carpet that was great, because I had a really stressful moment. Marlo was upset before I left and I didn't want to go. And, yeah. um, and I arrived there and they play music on the oh. red carpet and they put on this oh, like really? I no 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 know it's that. amazing so is that everywhere in Cannes at, only on in Cannes and on that main carpet in the yeah, main yeah. place in Cannes and they were playing like a ZZ Top song and I was suddenly yeah. like <laughs> right in the mood and I was like this is the key because okay. it just lifted me out of my terrible oh, that's nice funk. though yeah I mean they don't do that anywhere else no, right but they should Oscars do they do the, the Oscars on the no, no they might play intense but this was like oh I mean you don't need that yeah you just need something it's a bit light and a bit like the Oscars okay, I don't oh. think they do maybe no I don't I can't I mean what about the Met what about the Met do they do anything no with just a lot of and it's a lot of shouting I really, I really look at me, look at me, look at me, look at me. <laughs> like being oh, oh my god yeah. oh right okay. some people are better at it I get I mean, really just, I just sort of, I, yeah, I don't. I do you have a look? That. Do you have a, like a stance? No, or such? people no. do apparently practice them. Yeah, I know they do. Like, you always told me I should. <laughs> yeah, I, but I mean, be only because I would think, oh my god, I look <laughs> you good like that. that. You like we work out and we practice, so practice. Yeah. I can't do that. I get nervous, giggle, and then I'm like, <laughs> yeah. I mean, I mean, listen. You can decide to do all these things before it happens. But when you go there, it, you just just get through it, right? And you don't want to sound unappreciative because it's amazing to celebrate something. Yeah, I know, but it's quite nerve-wracking. But it's right? not that fun. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, me. yeah. Do you think it's like being at a football match? Um, oh, look, we're sharing today. A football match? What? Being a player in a football match? Well, just the like the tension. It's like go now. Oh, you know. Or I've got to jump off this diving ball now. It's your turn now. Right, that's like doing a play would be being a football. Okay, player. okay, so, yeah, okay. Yeah, it's terrifying, but at least you're fulfilling your creative passion at the same time. Yeah. Or your hopeful talent. But a red carpet is just like, go! Ah! Uh, right. Like, move, mm. like, push Because will that be a 100 metre sprint? It might be, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a bit, oh! a bit, a bit, a bit, 
yeah, yeah, yeah. that's aging myself because yeah. I should have said Usain Bolt. Yeah, I mean, I don't know why you did say that. Limpet Christie. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Now I just grunted. Yeah. <laughs> you got Linford. Yeah, you I'll have some millennials going. How's Linford Christie? No offence to Linford Christie. No, I very, mean he was major. He was major. Major. <laughs> How are you on Linford? Yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. So, what's your worst beauty habit? I don't know. I mean, I wash my face before I go to bed, yeah. even if I've had a few. I These said, days, I didn't used to. I used to wake up with makeup everywhere and it looked amazing. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> I used to do that too. I used to think I'd look better Early than I yeah. I used to go to bed and my makeup wake up and be like, oh, oh my God, yeah. killing me again. <laughs> yeah. Just that slept. Or maybe thing. you were just still drunk and still just drunk, drunk and yeah. just thought everything yeah. was yeah. right. Yeah. Or maybe just 22. Yeah, where true. everything looks yeah. right. just bounces back. No, I do wash my face now. And if I don't, I feel pretty gross in the morning. Yeah. Um, um, what else would I? Oh, I don't clean my. I don't think I've ever oh. cleaned a brush. Okay, well that's bad. Is that I mean, bad? that's that is bad. But if I clean my face, my brush is not dirty. Well, they are because you know how much dust is in these apartments. Have you ever gone like that along your windowsill? I mean, not I sound like an old. Um, like what's granny? Like, yeah, 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 yeah well that's dirty. Well, it's kind yeah. of from with the hair thingy and going okay. curry or something. Oh, oh, oh Mr. 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 Mr.
we and needed everything. an orangey one that I was yeah, a little yeah. bit unsure about. But, but we pushed worked. it anyway, and it worked. <laughs> Funny that. Um, and I, it's one of I, I like. I love. I love girls wearing no makeup. To be truthful, like that's yeah. my my favorite thing. If I could get away, with, you know. It's I just, mean, because everyone says, you know, it was Sienna Miller boho look which you done quite well, which was just you being you. No makeup. Yeah, and just you being you, and yeah. cool clothes. And I always think girls look better with no makeup, really. Yeah. Everyone I know. I mean, not necessarily. But <laughs> you know, all of my friends rested with no makeup yeah. is my favorite yeah. version. I mean, it's or quite- maybe a bit of Wendy Skip. Yeah, I mean, the thing is, it's quite nice, I suppose, sometimes when you go out and you look a bit different. Yeah, I think makeup's about changing it up a bit. Right? I'm not, not, oh yeah, this is about makeup. <laughs> yeah, I mean, hello, it's a channel about I think everyone should not, <laughs> yeah, you know, all right. Um, yeah, but it's about playing around and it can really enhance your mood I and mean, change your mood and yeah. make you feel better. And also, I think for you, you can quite do... You need it. You know, no, <laughs> Don't no. go thinking you can walk around without it. Which I do every morning. She really needs it. Yeah, yeah. No, um, yeah. I mean, she always gets paps on the school. At 8.15 in the morning. I mean, what nightmare. <laughs> uh, so like going like, there's the no way, oh. there's no way I'm going to be putting on a look. No, I, but you always look cool. You breakfast. always got, like, even what you throw on is really annoyingly cool. It's um, true. It's true. Um, and we all know that um, um no what was my thing i was going to say to you you can wear quite you're probably i mean i'm quite lucky enough to be doing sienna and she is one of these people that i can do basically anything on i can go from classic to a nude to fresh to sporty to fashion mm. to just anything to trends, yeah. I'm, I mean, you're quite. You've got that ultimate face. I'm lucky enough to. Have you I'm go. lucky to have you do. Yeah. So last question, because we're both really busy. <laughs> um, <clears throat> how's your look evolved over the years? Would you say personally? Let's not talk about when you're going on the red carpet and stuff. But I mean, personally, do you think it's changed over the years? Like. Something you used to really do and you like either don't do or do more of. I think I used to do quite a lot of bronzer. <laughs> oh, <right. laughs> but, but because I sort of had a tan all the time and I have freckles, my freckles have now just sort of either been just blended into one or disappeared. A bit. <laughs> I used to get a bronzer and just be like like all over there and that's cute. Yeah, that is cute. I think I've I don't know, I've I've cut my hair and then I think with and I've had different hair colours and, and that was that's really jarring when you have yeah. I've had to dye it brown or red for jobs. Movies, yeah. And you you can't wear like a red lipstick with orange hair. It just didn't yeah, look yeah, right on yeah, me yeah, or yeah. whatever. So Which one of McDonald's? But I think I still I still am the same in lots of ways. The things yeah. that I like and the way that I like people to look is the same. Because you But yeah. I wear more makeup because I you need do? more makeup. Do you? Well just to go out. I mean I used to do my own makeup for real. I used to not have a style, I used to just do it all myself. I mean we don't like that, do we? Um yeah. It's much <laughs> I mean thank now. God things have changed. Um, uh, I mean, you got me to do that with that the fresh glow golden radiance to put it on your cheek and across your nose. And, uh, yeah, and that was really good. Another tip that she gave me. I when I get tan, which is when I look best. Although I can't really go in the sun anymore because I get the little patches of weirdness. But I used to get brownness on the bridge of my nose yeah, and under my eyes. It looks super cute. And that makes it's quite a youthful place to bronze. I mean, whenever me. I'm asked about you, people always say, how do you get that sun-kissed glow um, that Sienna has? Do they? Yeah. And I say, Maybe she's, she's born with it. Yeah, but she's <laughs> born with it, babe. Um, yeah, so... Um, <laughs> bit of fresh glow. Yeah, a bit of fresh glow. But you always look really healthy. Because oh, you work you out. you see me looking unhealthy. Yeah, I know, but yeah. we don't look unhealthy. You dragged me out yeah, of bed. Yeah, yeah. I well, don't well, want to do it. But, you know, I mean, at least I don't have to go on camera and don't want to do it. Right, yeah. that's a difference. You work out. I do right. now. But did you I've used started to? to? No. Did you not? I'd say I properly worked out really for only the last two months I've started to. No, that's a lie. It's because not. It was like once a week. But you used to do um, yoga teacher. You used to have a yoga teacher, no? Yeah, once a week. Oh. I mean, scraping the bottom of the barrel. Um, yeah, I was not. Oh. I'm not someone who's managed to do an every day. Actually, for American Sniper, I had a trainer. That's a lie. Oh right, okay. Because I played and a woman who was really fit. And how often did you used to do that? She came out to. We were training maybe three times a week for a month. 
Okay. And then she came out to LA before we started shooting for two weeks and she did all my diet. Did you notice a difference? F4 Baker, she's amazing. She yeah. came out to LA with me uh, this for is... the two weeks before I started shooting American yeah. Sniper. Yeah, and then you felt your body changed. Yeah. Was it a look that you wanted? Because obviously... She was really athletic and much, and I was like, I can I can be kind of skinny fat. That's my natural. Yeah, but that's quite. Kind of, you know. No, 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 but not toned. She was very toned and quite strong. She was married to a Navy Seal. I mean, but guy. what did she give you a body so that we were you were happy with? Yeah, or, or, or yeah. was it just for the part? It was more for the part. But would you go? Oh, I love this. I'm going to try and keep it. Or not? Um, I felt quite kind of ripped. Oh. Okay. I like I like I t I like quite natural you know yeah. I, I think Victoria's Secret girls are obviously dreamy and yeah, but those girls but I like quite, kind of um, yeah. I like a tiny tummy on a girl yeah you like, like, I just yeah. think it's quite natural, natural yeah. yeah you don't have to be a rock yeah so I like a bit of a bum and I like a tiny little belly I yeah think it's cute yeah that is nice um, but you know not a bingo wing yeah <laughs> I started <laughs> yeah, <not so> <laughs> oh, hence I don't have the uh, short sleeves on no, I'm joking um, it's like when you're driving and you're like, Yay! Or wave to someone goodbye. So, <laughs> um, <laughs> so, but you're doing Soul Cycle now, right? I do a bit of Soul Cycle, yeah. Yeah. I mean, do you like that? I do. I like it because it's 45 minutes. I don't have the patience to do a lot. Yeah. It has to be intense, and I, my attention span's not great. Last I like dancing around a bit. Yeah. You I know. love yoga and it's good for my head. Yeah. I did a training session at this place called AKT in New York yeah. and they do like a dance cardio. Oh right, okay. Do you like that? Yeah. Okay. They had bands from the scene and there's a mirror right. and do like a little dance. Oh right, okay. It's quite loud. Oh, but, oh, hold on a minute. You've done cabaret. So did you have a choreographer for that? Did yes, you have to train yes. for that? I got Because yeah, I wanted to talk for that. that. Yeah. Because I was dancing, I was in rehearsal for six weeks and I was dancing for four hours a day. I mean, so but I got way too skinny. How long not did to be not in an annoying long, way? I looked unhealthy because it was so much adrenaline and so much. So exercise. how long did you have to train before you went on stage for that? Because that's Five interesting. Five weeks, six weeks. And how 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 long every day? I would rehearse from ten till six. What dancing all day? Dancing and, and scene obviously work, nine, but a lot of choreo and singing. Oh right, I had to sing too. So a combination of singing, acting, and dancing, dreamy in a rehearsal room in New York. Yeah. With like leg warmers, and I did. Oh my god, did you go for the full on tights with the leotard over the top? Oh, and I would love leg warmers. I just put a coat over the top but, but and be like, oh, Yeah, like, but you need to be skinny to rock that look because you know you just look like I everyone. Got, I got like, I was really sick doing it, that play. It yeah. really, it was really hard. How long was it? Well, I took over, and Michelle Williams started it, and then Emma Stone took over, and then she had to drop out, so I just finished the run. So I only oh, right, did okay. seven weeks. Okay. I okay. would have done it for a year. I've never oh, been right, so okay, happy. cool. But I think I was so sick by the end that it was probably good that it stopped. And I was the skinniest I've ever, ever, ever been. Oh, right. I mean, not, then, in a, not in a good way. Then time. it would have been pizzas mm. all around, ice cream. There was pizzas it. on the way home, but it's because of the adrenaline. Yeah. And it was like, a, she's a real nihilist. It was like a dark I mean, place. I'm, Plus you're sick and sweating because you're dancing sick. Yeah. So it was not, it was like. Okay. I mean, I never got a chance to see that because I, I wasn't like, in New York at the time, but. No, you were. Okay. No, I wasn't. Okay. I know, I wasn't very on her own with a bottle of champagne. <laughs> I know, I didn't get a chance to see that. I, I would have really loved that. It was so fun. Yeah. I mean, are we going to see you in any other dancing thing? I want to do cabaret again. Oh, okay. Not Maybe even not that version, but if, if it kills me, I will be in that play again. I'll probably be... Um, Fraulein Schneider, who's the old... <laughs> she's the old... Like, I don't really know. All I know about that play is... Uh, welcome, welcome in cabaret, welcome, bienvenue. Oh, see, I've done even fucking other words. Yeah, welcome in. Well, you know, set in Berlin, so that's German yeah. for welcome. Welcome, yeah, I know that. I've done German at school for four years. Okay. So it rubbed off. <laughs> <laughs> you said welcome and, and welcome bienvenue. and bienvenue. <laughs> welcome in. I oh hope. Oh my god. I mean, anyway, um, I, I would like to do that one. And sometimes Alan Cumming, who was the MC, he. He oh, he wheels great, me yeah. out to do like one number from Cabaret at like a fundraiser for the Met or so oh, I sometimes okay. dip back in and And you I remember it all, right? Obviously. I remember the words of the songs, I can't I can rem I can't I don't Can know. you remember the dance routines? <clears throat> no. No, it's funny that. Do you think you have to be like I can remember like a bit like I had to learn the Charleston. Did, That's quite fun. Did you go to acting school? No. I mean uh, I ask everyone this because I'm obsessed. I No, I to went go. to Lee Strasberg here for three months. Oh so I've got the cap. That I went to yeah, the gym. yeah, yeah. I took you there. Yeah. Um, I didn't do like a three month. I didn't get into Lambda. 
I mean, I, I mean, as a novice, I have no idea what she's talking about. The London <laughs> Academy of Music and Dramatic Art. Oh, right, okay. And lots of people who are acting didn't get into drama school, so don't be discouraged if you don't. Oh, right, okay. Um, I didn't really try, I did a bit at Lee Strasberg, which I loved, which is method acting. Okay, did you do dance and sing in there? Because obviously no. you had to do that anyway. The only dancing I've done is... Out. You just have to get on with it, right? Yeah. And you just wasn't learn, you scared? You learn. I had an you amazing think? teacher. She was an yeah. amazing choreographer. I was ter I've never been so scared. It's like, what about the singing? The singing, I can. I love singing. It's my total. Yeah, and you had singing lessons before. Secret. I sang at school. I've never had like professional singing lessons. Yeah. you have to train because to vocally sustain a show. Yeah. On Broadway, I mean, it's, quite it's very different to my like. I can sing with the guitar and sound like a little bit bluesy, but I'm not yeah. like la. Oh, um, wow. So yeah. I really had to, and that was what was weird about what happened. My neck got very strong oh. looking, so well, I looked quite the old horse neck, skinny with like a, <laughs> slightly like that. Oh, wow. raptor in Jurassic Park, you know? Yeah, like yeah, yeah. Like yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was my chest and neck. It was oh. all really, real muscly. Oh, okay. Um, but no, I got trained by amazing people. I suppose we should finish up now. Yeah. Yeah. There's the chimes, the chimes, chime, the bell. <gasps> okay, so um, this was Sienna Hello. with me on my YouTube channel. Thanks so much. Go to wendyrad.com. Oh, yeah. <laughs> be there, I'll be square. <laughs> That's a bit old. You can't see with us. We made you. No, come watch, enjoy. Um, it's all fun and easy, and you might learn something. Is that your tagline? I don't know, I that's just made it up. That's, I feel like you said that before. <laughs> I just don't know how to wrap it up. How do I wrap it up? That's quite good. Come along, have fun. You might learn something. <laughs>